Occasionally, the luck runs out. Young Italian. Oh, he's lost the ski and he goes. Well, at least he goes. He survived for quite a long while without going. But once he'd lost that right ski. <laughs> And the force of that fall knocking off Cooper's crash hat. But remarkably, she was all right. And so was Zoe Haas of Switzerland, who made good use of the very same safety net. And amongst the lower numbers now, this is Chip Warren Cox. Split 41, 42, 18, and the computer tells us that's 12th fastest. So he's lost a little bit, but he's still goal. Oh, he's not going well, he's gone. And Cochrane with a bad fall. Right into the safety nets, into the powder snow, and he looks to be okay. Okay. Yep, standing up in the powder, but that was bump 70 hit, and my goodness, he hit it very hard indeed, and uh, lucky to be caught by those nets, I think. He won't like that. Son of a bitch. Of course, this is the man who robbed Bartels of his victory in Valgadena by 11. Oh, and he won't do it today, and rest snow plows down through. 
He's all right. Yes, holds up his hand to say he's all right. But the ski is separated completely. He's done even what the great Moser Pro couldn't accomplish. Oh, and that's as high as Moser. And she hit the tails and she's recovered. That is amazing. Just one example of what it takes to be a ski champion. But every now and then, the ice, the snow, and the speed beats even the best.